Hello, welcome back to Mrs Hewitt's Spelling at Home and we have got some more work on apostrophes today but we are not using the word not. So we're going to talk about um, how you would talk about somebody, maybe yourself or maybe um, using he or she or we or they and describing them. So if I was going to say that I am a teacher, I would say I am a teacher and I would use these words I am okay so we've got I am now with the um, with the am again these words can be merged together and this one gets contracted gets shorter and we end up losing a letter and we have to put an apostrophe in where we lose a letter so I am that a actually goes and we end up with this which says I'm okay so if you see this written anywhere with this little apostrophe here and it says I'm that is actually short for I am okay and they've taken the a away so we've got I am so I am I'm okay so I am a teacher I'm a teacher okay mean the same thing and we might then talk about somebody else so we might be talking about um Oh, I don't know who could we talk about one of our friends and we might say he is um, he is outside okay so um, we're telling we're describing where he is we're saying he is outside so instead of saying he is as two words you've guessed it they can be shortened they can be combined and we take away the I of is so he is this one goes and it becomes He's okay. So if you see this and it says he's with the apostrophe, that apostrophe is replacing the I of the is. So he's means he is. So now we've got I'm and we've got he's, and we can do exactly the same with she because we have she is and then we have she's. So she's going out tonight. She is going out tonight. Okay, so we've got he's and she's. And we've got I'm for I am. And if we're going to talk about a group of people, we might talk about, um, including me, we might talk about we. So we might say we are all in this together or we are all doing this now. We are all learning. Um, so we are or we are watching telly, okay? And they can get contracted and combined. And this A in the R disappears. So we lose the A of we are, and we end up with this. And this says we're, we're. So if you, again, if you see this, because if it didn't have an apostrophe, that would say were, okay? So that is the word were. With an apostrophe there, it is we're, because it's short for we are. It's the A, that little apostrophe is basically replacing the A. Okay, so it says we're, we're watching telly, we're going out later. Okay, so we have got we're, and exactly the same as we're, we have got they are, and that A goes, and instead of the A, we have the apostrophe. So this says there, okay? There are three different there's that you need to learn. It's quite complicated, okay? But what you need to remember is if we're talking about them, we're talking about some other people, and we're talking about what they are doing. So we could say they, they're running, or they're enjoying their lessons, okay? So it's basically, if we want to say they are, we can shorten it to there, but we still need to acknowledge that there was an A there, okay? So we need to um, replace the A with the apostrophe and we need to say there. So if you're writing there and you think, oh, could I, could, is this a they are there? Because if it is, then that's the one you need to use, okay, for there, for they are. So we have got five different apostrophe words that we've learned today, okay? So... Um, I want you to see if you can, first of all, read them out when I hold them up 
and then you're going to write them and put them in a sentence as well okay so get ready to um, shout them at me when I hold them up at the screen are you ready well done that is I'm we've got this one she's mm, jumbled them up a bit we've got this one there this one he's and this one we're okay we're that's right and I've written some sentences to give you some clues of what you might choose to write. So you can go away and write sentences with these. Now, just like I was doing before, I've written both versions. So you can see here I've written, I am a teacher. And then I've written, I'm a teacher. OK, and I've written, he is good at running. He's good at running. So we've got both versions. He is and he's. We've got, we are waiting. We're waiting and then down here I've written they're going out so they are going out okay so there's lots of um, games that you can find online that are to do with apostrophes as well so if this is something that you think oh, actually I could do a bit more practice at that have a little search um, and you will find some games online um, that will help you practice your apostrophes um, but again, the best thing for you to do really is look out for them in your reading, OK, because they will be in lots of the books that you're reading. So with those um, five words, so I'm, he's, she's, we're and there, um, can you write some sentences um, using each of them? And again, just keep looking out for them, keep spotting those apostrophes. OK, good luck. I'll see you back tomorrow. Bye.